Hey guys, there's been a few people that have asked what they can do to get their Sarama ready for a tabletop competition. Um, I'm gonna use this little guy because he's still learning. He's an absolute disaster right now. Um, so I am going to, what I wanna do is I wanna <laughs> teach this guy, good boy, to stay on the table. If he um, insists on flying off the table, then <clears throat> I can make like a little cage contraption that just goes around the, the table to keep him here, right? So instead of me constantly chasing after him, I just put this here to say, hey, just stay right here and he'll learn that. Um, what I don't wanna do is I don't ever wanna let him jump off of the table. So for starters, if he ever acts like he's going to jump off of the table, then I will either stop him or I will pick him up because I just don't want him to do that. So what you want is you want them to pose for you. And this guy, I'm gonna ask to, there we go, to move his little head all the way back in his chest, okay? Because this is what we want. Good boy. There, there. Good boy, good boy. Okay, so good boy, yes, yes. So he's gonna act like a giraffe right now because there's stuff going on. We've got a thunderstorm <laughs> fixing to move in. And uh, so he's gonna be a little bit of a looky-loo. So, and you wanna keep your sessions short. Anytime that you're working with any kind of a critter, keep your sessions short. So if he's, if he's, if I'm picking up that he, has hit the threshold of his patience and it's just gonna turn into a fight with him, then I will just pick him up and I will end the session. So, and we just had a really close, yep, lightning bolt. So I'm gonna end the session now.